Oops, recovered a misspelled phoenix down. I demand complete loyalty. You are subservient to me. You can't question my authority. Ah, uh, no. Edgar's not like that. He's not that kind of evil person. He's a kind of weird, awkward, groping kind of evil person. Not a um, tyrant who conquers lands. That's Castell's territory. Equip relics to uh, gain a variety of abilities. He's double my walking speed. Whee! Ow! Okay, so... Uh, hello. Well, let's give the party members a variety of abilities. For example, Spencer's double your speed. True knight that you shield others during battle. Dragoon boots had the jump command to your battle list. Grant that allows you to hold a sword with both hands. Use the main menu to equip up the two relics per person. Barhammer. Okay, I want sprint shoes. They remove a lot of the headache of this uh, place. Of traveling. Let's see, what else do I want? Star pen and predicts against poison. Goggles predict against dark. Star pendants are very useful. I'm going to take three of those. Jewel ring protects against dark. Petrify. True and I. Uh, that's all I'm going to take. Uh, let me see. Go into my menu. Equip some relics. Edgar. Star pendant for you. Relic for lock will be star pendant. Relic for Terra will be uh, star pendant and sprint shoes. Perfect. Now look at me. No more slow walking. Wee! I can run really fast. Hey, no, I don't want to pay for resting. I'm back in the quote-unquote cafe. Screw this place. Bunch of smelly weirdos drinking their chai lattes. Do 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 do. See what else we got here in this peaceful little kingdom. <gasps> a weapon store arsenal. Uh, can't you just say a black like a ah? Okay, um, mithril blade. Let's see what we're with. Rainbow cutlass. Ooh, that's good. It's very good. Gonna buy just one for Terra. Mithril blade for just to conserve some money. Dirk. Dirk a dirk a dirk. her with the Regal Cutlass. Even though she's mostly a magic user, magic isn't particularly all that efficient at this point. Only for select enemies, I would rely mainly on main attacks. That's just how I play it. I mean, you can play by your own rules if you want. Hairband. My biggest problem with... Uh, like, I find it weird that there's hairbands and that there's so much superior stuff. Like, it doesn't make it clear... Because I actually don't know if cloth armor in typical RPG fashion is better stat-wise for caster-based characters that I want to use, but it's, I guess it doesn't really matter. I mean, I'm not going to be casting much, so I'll get the best there is, I guess. It's been a while since I played all the way through this, so you can understand if I'm a little rusty. Kung Fu suit. Cotton robe. Like, I know certain characters can only use certain, uh, uh, armor types. Like, you can't use one thing on everything. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Got Optimum. This is such a useful thing. I, was this the first Final Fantasy to use this? I'm not huge on the history and which ones made which advancements, but it's such a useful tool to just press a button and immediately set you up with the best gear. Mount Colts is to the east. Ah, oh, lag. Oh, it's a uh, item shop. Crap, 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 crap. I, uh, okay, I don't need to use much items at this point. I guess I can buy some eye drops. Uh, soft antidote. I have, uh, yeah, I'm a little low on funds right now. So I'm gonna go out and continue my magical journey of. Oh, I sell some houses to check out. 
my grandfather was a servant to the richest man in town. I'm the richest man in town now. I am the king. He will serve me. Your king demands an audience. I don't like strangers. Bring me some cider and maybe I'll talk to you. I am the king. You will bow. Anything here? Anything here? Receive tonic. I knew that old man's a drunk. Okay, let's see where I... I'm sure there's some still some places I need to check out. Ooh, what's this over there? I'm... I'm an old man, lady. Uh, this town will go down fighting. Even with Magitek armor, we'll make it tough on them. Yeah, I... Magitek armor isn't that impressive. I pretty much slayed two of those. My husband Duncan is a world famous martial artist. He's taken his disciples to Mount Colts for meditation and training. Okay, he's got some kind of weird, creepy hippie cult going on there. Bunch of sweaty, naked guys doing martial arts on a mountain. Sounds like a cult. Saving for no apparent reason. or some kind of uh, Charles Bronson fan club. Maybe Sabin's there. He likes beating stuff up. He can break... He can suplex a train. I'm just letting you guys know that. And I'm going to try to be able to do that when the time arises. It's probably its most well-known holy crap moment. Rodox and Grease Monks. Oh, see? These guys make sense. They, uh, have a wrench, and they're grease monkeys. Compare this to the stupid Repo Man. Repo Man do not carry wrenches. Why would they? Like, are they gonna go up to, uh, your stuff you owe money? And, like, you only owe a little bit of money, so rather than repossessing this big extravagant piece of machinery, I'm gonna unscrew with this wrench, I'm gonna pull and pry this little bolt out, and just take it bit by bit. That's not what repo men do. <gasps> cabbages! Cabbage, 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 cabbage! Turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up! Hmm. What is this place? Hmm. What's that smell? It smells divine. It smells like a lady. Flower is his favorite. These dishes, they were his favorite. And this, his favorite tea. His favorite tonic. His favorite table. His favorite box. His favorite chair. Oh, it's... What the heck? We're sleeping in it? What I find creepy about this is... This guy just left his house out and there's a bunch of random people coming and sleeping together in the same bed. What did these three do during that period and what motivated them to say, Hey, let's get in the bed. What's wrong with these people? This isn't even their house. These people just met. Sabin, he, he was here. Uh, I'm an old man. I'm just standing around this house for no reason. What the? You know this guy? Uh, of course. He, he left a couple of days ago when he heard Master Duncan was slain. He, he was heading for them mountains. I heard Duncan's son Vargas is missing as well. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh no, where am I going? Why am I just walking out the back? I don't know, I'm scared. <laughs> Majestic land traveling music. And ladies and gentlemen, oh, we're going to Mount Colts. This place is actually probably the first place that has a bit of legitimate challenge. It's not super hard, and those uh, poison immunity things will help us with a particular enemy that can poison us, and it's annoying. Stop throwing wrenches, you weird kidney bean technician. Bum ba ba bum ba ba mound colds. I love this music.
Oh, schnoops. Tuskers. You know, how much health does Terra have? Can she heal herself? Oh, why am I doing Why am I wasting magic? I just realized I healed at that place. I thought Terra was low, but she's not. She's not going to get any... Oh, she is. So, do we just sleep in the bed not to get rest? Why did we go in that bed? And why does the bed trigger an old man to show up and freak out about some guy named Duncan? Da -da 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 -da. Oh, use the auto crossbow even when it's one person. Because it does over 100 damage. It's pretty sweet. Down you go. Tuskers. Luck gained a little. Okay, yeah. I don't know. Okay, actually, rather than waste more of my precious, precious magic, I'm gonna use some of these tonics. Yeah, I should have heeded that weird guy's advice and spent 80 gold or gil. I'm gonna call it gil, because that's usually what Final Fantasy is, the money. It's gil, not gold. But what pieces or points or whatever the P stands for. I should have had a nap at this place. I just figured since I was going to be randomly sleeping in Duncan's bed, uh, like some kind of weird uh, grad party, uh, stop punching Tara. Tara gained a level, got 164. If this is gold pieces, not gil, do you have any idea how much, even like in Victorian area, 168 pieces of gold? You would be rich beyond your wildest imagination just with that. Pieces of gold. Gold is worth a lot. Heal yourself, Terra. But you see what I mean? It's getting a tiny bit tougher and you have to be quicker. Auto crossbow. Boom. Gore. That yeah, gore does 69 damage. It sucks. Friggin' birds. Why are they called Serpius? That's a strange name for a bird. There is some really weird names in this translation, but overall it still is my favorite version of the game. This is the, f the only one of the Super Nintendo translations that were original release Super Nintendo that are consistently like good translations with really nothing to complain about. Now I should have bought a tent. I hope I find one on the way because I really... having that extra magic could help with this last fight. I'm, I shouldn't be in over my head this early in the game. Tent here? Yay! Conveniently placed tent in a treasure chest up in the mountains. You saved my life. Trillium. Trillium's a mineral, isn't it? Not a plant? Or is that a Latin name for a, a, a genus of plants? Just like uh, the genus of plants of sage is genus sage. Really forced Tales of Symphonia reference. Yeah, I never played the sequel to that. I heard it's not as good. I heard it's decent, just not as good as the original. Only thing Tales really has over uh, a lot of its contemporaries is its... Uh, is its... Crap, heal, 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 heal. It is its combat, which I really like. I'm magic! Can't you tell? Oh man, these guys, what are these, these Bruce Lee wannabes? Nah, they don't look like Bruce Lee. Who has a really long ponytail that looks really unfashionable? Actually, these guys kind of remind me of Vega from Street Fighter, or the original Balrog, if you're a purist who thinks the original names are always supreme. I prefer Vega, it's a bit more frou-frou, and that suits the egotistical jerkwad Vega is. Uh, let me see.